What's up everybody? Thanks for being here and in today's video we are talking all about buttons. Hey, I'm Elizabeth Muller, founder of Bloom Creative Company, a Squarespace design agency, and today we are doing a deep dive on buttons. How to link a PDF, how to have someone directly call you from a button or directly email you from a button on your site. We're going to walk through all that in a screen share, so let's dive in. So we are in our site and we're going to add some flair to our buttons here. So let's just work on this demo page. We clicked edit, we're in here. Here's our button block. So to further edit your button, uh, you're going to hover over and it's going to show a pencil. So I'm going to bring this to the middle and I'm going to show you all the different ways that you can connect your button uh, for the sake of making things simpler on mobile, whether you want a button for someone to call you really quick or directly email you and have that pop up or just even on desktop to make things a lot quicker. You know, buttons look awesome and they draw attention. So let's jump in. You're gonna click the gear there. Now, the first thing that we're gonna do is a web address. So if we're gonna link a web address and that is any other web address, www.facebook.com, google.com, whatever you wanna link out to. Now, a huge pet peeve of mine is when you're on someone's website, you click a link and it completely bounces you off their site. So you worked so hard to get that traffic onto your site. Always make sure if you're providing a link that is not within your website, open it in a new window so you do not lose that effort that you put in to get someone there. Now here's a page. This will link your button to any other page in your site. Once you click here, it will bring up all of your pages within your site. Pretty self-explanatory. If you wanted it to open up in a new window, you could. You don't have to. Now email. So if someone clicks the button, it will automatically open their email. So I'm on a Mac and if I put my hello at bloomwebsitedesign.com and I click the button, it will open up my inherent email in my computer. So whatever platform someone's on, they click it, it will open up their email. Now you can pre-fill what information you want. So if you have an email button on each page, this might be a good idea to say, email about, so if this was on a copywriting page, since we provide copywriting, if the button was to email about copywriting, I might put in this subject, copywriting inquiry or copywriting question. If it was on the contact page, maybe email from contact page. So, so you can kind of track where your emails are coming from. I feel like that would be really important if you are testing, if you wanted to see where all your traffic was going and which button, I mean, you could even change the color of all the different buttons and you could track which button is performing the best. Um, and that kind of goes into the file as well. But this is what you would fill out. You don't have to fill out the body or the CC or BC, BCC, but if you wanted to, you could. Phone, this is where you put your phone number in and it would directly call. So this is great on mobile, on the mobile device. If someone wants to give you a call and you're given the option, they click it, it it will prompt them in their phone, call yes or no. And then file. So this is this is something that I hear a lot about, how to download a file directly from your website. So what you're going to do first is you're gonna upload a file. You'll click this, it will open up the file in your computer and it will pull up your downloads. Or you can pull up your downloads, drag, and drop it right in here in that plus. So this is a lead mag that the, I have on my website and I'm gonna show you what that looks like really quick. We're gonna open it up in a new window because you don't wanna open up that new file and then they have to figure out how to get back to your site. So we'll open a new window and then a check mark will appear at whatever file you want to have load. So I'm gonna click save here. Down here you can change the size of your button, small, medium, or large and then the alignment, left, center, or right. Hit apply, save. So if this is my lead magnet and this is my landing page that someone is landing on and I wanna get their, their attention with something, provide some value, they'll click on lead, learn more, and there it is. And since it's on a typical web browser, they have the option to download this right to their computer. So. There's my PDF and it is as simple as that. It opened up in a new tab and I can click right back. I hope you got a ton of value in that video and I hope that I was able to break it down so simply for you that you can go and do this right now. 
If you have any requests for any type of video walkthroughs, I am all ears. I want to be able to make content for you that helps you with maintaining your site. Now, if you are a business and you're struggling, that's what we do. We are so happy to help. You can find our email in the notes below. But other than that, do me a favor and smash that subscribe button so you get every video that we put out so you can help, so I can help you make your site the best that it can be and make you more money and save you some time. So thanks for being here. Stand by for the next video.